I heard a rumor. Crocodile board coming today. Not yet. Come on. Come on. Oh. Mm. Mm. I see a little silhouette of a van. Got the box, got the box coming to my front door. Ooh, is it heavy? Looks heavy. Oh. Oh. oh, could it be? <coughs> diggy, 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 long. <gasps> Fragile. Must be French. Okay. All right, so this is my first unboxing ever. Uh, I'm guessing this is my brand new crocodile board from my friend, new friend, Ted Fuller, Crocodile Canada. Hence the, the French, Fragile. So yeah, let's dig into this thing, see how, how it looks. So, a few weeks ago, I went down the YouTube rabbit hole that I like to do, and I discovered the grand Canadian game of Crokinole. Uh, Crokinole is curling meets darts meets shuffleboard. Um, yeah, so if you would be interested in the rules of the game, feel free to check that out online. But uh, after much research and looking at different boards and things. Of course, I know nothing about this game, but I discovered Crokinole Canada, Ted Fuller. And um, yeah, so I called to ask some questions and who picks up the phone but Ted. And he was running through the different types of boards and rules and different things for me, uh, expanding on my recent YouTube knowledge. and. Uh, we decided on a board from a company called Tracy. Uh, I'd have to look up to see his first name, but it's uh, another fellow named Tracy um, versus even Ted's board. But he suggested getting this one because of the speed. I guess you need speed in Crokinole. Um, but yeah, so received this today and let's check it out. So we've got a bottle totally written in French. Oh, here we go. It was written in French on one side. Shuffleboard wax. Fast speed, moisture proof. Colored shuffleboard wax. This is packed in here nice. Camera. So I did grab the uh, case go with the shuffleboard so that's what sides we're looking at here. My wife is gonna love all of the styrofoam all over the place. We'll have to get the vacuum on a little later I think. Tin, I believe uh, this would be the 20s tin. That's so whenever you're scoring a 20. In there. Um, this would appear to be more of the wax for the board. He did say he was sending me two different speeds of wax. So apparently there are two different speeds of wax. Ooh, fancy. Super 
fancy. I know there are other items in this box too, so hopefully I don't destroy them. <laughs> Bring it out. Oh, it's a beaut. She's a beaut. Oh. Yes. Looking glass sensor. Get yourself a security system that lets you know every time you drop something. Yes. There it is, check that out. The Tracy board. See, we got Tracy boards right here. Wow, that is smooth. Nice. Get kind of cleaned up, clean up around here and take a closer look. All right, so I've got everything out of our box here. Trusty board case. Uh, so Ted put together a, he calls it a kit with me. So kind of uh, put a package together, uh, a little different than um, the ones that he had on his website, uh, Crokinole CA, I believe Crokinole.ca, uh, one of those combinations. I think if you just search Crokinole, you, you would come across it. So uh, let's see what we got here. All right, so. the customer. I'll read that later. Uh, we have, uh, saw some mention of this on the website, the Bible Times. So this is a newspaper that Ted and his family put together. Um, it's a Christian based company, which I think is pretty cool. So we will take a deeper look at that a little later. And then of course we've got uh, the game of Crokinole. A family tradition since 1876. Been around a little while. Uh, apparently in Canada, you'll find these boards around, um, you know, at the lake home. Um, grandma and grandpa usually always have them around, apparently. Uh, maybe kind of like a, a cribbage board or something here in the U.S. So, we'll see if it comes down here, though. Um, apparently some friends of ours recently grabbed a crokinole table as well. Um, and just randomly had it. The other day, and it looks like Ted's business card. Uh, so the kit, we've got a pair of Crokinole cues. Uh, I guess you don't use these too often, but they do add quite a bit to your uh, shooting ability. And we thought they'd be a good addition to have. This would be our Crokinole scoring board. So Crokinole has a few different methods of scoring, uh, tournament and the regular. Um, a normal way would be adding up your points and it would be a race to 100. So this board, one to four players, this board is set up for, for uh, four people. So I would imagine most of the time we'll just be using two of them. So I, I believe uh, Ted has these made for him by another company. There's a few small businesses that kind of with Crokinole. And these would be our 20s holders. So if you look into the rule, you would see hitting a, a disc and getting it to settle into that center circle would be 20 points. They call it a 20. And you would take those out right away and these will actually sit on the side of your, of your table and you would drop your 20s in and kind of keep track of those for scoring purposes. 20s holders. Um, I'm not sure how much we would use this, but this is a Lazy Susan to be able to spin the board. Uh, there are actually rules that require you to sit still in a game of Crokinole. They call it the one cheek rule. So you're planted in your seat and you need to stay one cheek on at all times. But um, yeah, they did think this would be kind of fun to use a Lazy Susan every once in a while. 
So we got four sets of discs. He has a few different sets on his website with a number of different types. We got the natural collection. Plenty of bright colors, green, orange, red. Generally, I think we'll be using just the two colors, but so we've got uh, lighter wood, black, white, and another wood color. Uh, of course, we've got our Tracy board and a nifty case if you want to take it to the friends. And most importantly, I think this might be my first t-shirt that my wife might not try to steal. Crokinole Canada, or Ted's company there. So yeah, can't wait to get this set up and try it out. So this is the new Crokinole board, 26 inches, so I've read. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to get too much into the rules, but uh, yeah, so we've got four sets. Black, white, as you can see there. Maybe you can see uh, on the wood. Try it out. Okay. The hanger, as they call it. So I haven't used any of the uh, shuffleboard wax yet. Apparently, you're going to put it in the trough here and you can kind of rub. Just a little bit. Never tried it before. already. Ooh. Okay. Oh. Boy, 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 boy. Rimmed it. Well, hopefully we'll be getting those 20s in no time, <laughs> or uh, 20s holders to good use. Oh, my wife is going to love this. <laughs> Crokinole, Ted Fuller, Crokinole Canada, check it out. <laughs> 